Welcome back to another weekly gaming roundup sponsored by Burger King. This week in gaming. There's been a bit of back and forth between Sony and Microsoft over Microsoft's acquisition of Activision, and with it, the Call of Duty franchise. Sony had said that an immensely popular game like Call of Duty influences users' choice of console, and that fans of the series are so loyal that another game, even of the same calibre, wouldn't be able to rival it. Microsoft submitted a rebuttal to Sony's objections and seems to jab at old Sony's own love of exclusivity arrangements. But Microsoft have reiterated and reassured that it won't be making Call of Duty exclusive, saying that it just wouldn't be profitable. The console wars between fans has always been like a my dad could beat up your dad argument. Except now the dads are really fighting. It's not quite the Randy Marsh spectacle it was imagined to be. It's more like a case on Judge Judy. Bless her. We got a short social trailer for Forspoken that the internet has decided to slate. The short clip contains some of the protagonist's dialogue, coming to terms with being somewhere other than Earth, having a talking sleeve, and being able to move things with her mind. It's a bit cliche and Whedon-esque, but this dialogue is already featured in an earlier trailer from 2021. But the trailer did at least give us a new release date of the 24th of January 2023. Some other trailers we got this week included a Saints Row reboot trailer ahead of the game's release on the 23rd of August. We got an extended look at Splatoon 3, Nintendo's paintball shooter, and a trailer for the upcoming 1.0 release of Temtem. If you're a fan of Pokemon or monster catching and battling games, but don't have a Switch or fancy something different, Temtem is an MMO that sees you journey through the airborne archipelago to become a Temtem tamer. It's been in early access since 2020 and finally sees its full release on the 6th of September. Cult of the Lamb released this week. The indie roguelike action game has been highly anticipated and the reception so far has been extremely positive. You play as a possessed lamb that was saved by some ominous stranger, and now you must repay this debt by creating a following devoted to them. It looks like a lot of fun. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe and follow for more videos every week, and for more gaming news and reviews, head to entertainment.ie gaming.